all done. sleep with a scarf on last night that's why I look crazy so I'm be doing is a pre poo because I need my hair to be as clean as possible when I do my own hair a silk press which is what I'm about to do today um, I need my hair extremely clean I mean you already need your hair extremely clean anyway if you want to get a really good press in but I'm gonna be doing what I used to do all the time which I stopped doing but I'm gonna be doing a pre poo with my coconut oil which I've already melted um, I have a bowl here. This is what I do for my hair when I want it extremely clean. I used to put coconut oil in my hair a lot back in college, which actually grew my hair, which I'm gonna start doing even more now. But anyway, I usually pre-poo and go in with the coconut oil and basically uh, finger detangle my hair first. So just grab some. And this will help with all that buildup. I have a lot of buildup in my hair. Gel and different products. If you see anything coming out, that's all that product. So this is just really good to uh, seal in a little bit of moisture as well before washing my hair. I got the plug on a They gonna find you like pre-pooing so I'm all done detangling my dirty hair <laughs> so so I just put the coconut oil all throughout and now we're about to wash it let me show you guys what I'm gonna be using to wash my hair daily hydrating conditioner and daily hydrating shampoo also I'm gonna wash my hair in sections so I'm gonna part it down the middle And I usually do four big sections. 
and it makes the washing so much faster as well. So I'm just gonna braid the sections up. Or not braid it, I'm gonna twist them. Let's go ahead and do these sections. Section. Okay, you guys, so I have my hair in these four sections. So that's how I'm gonna wash my hair today. Um, and then I'm actually, I just got this deep conditioner I'm gonna be using and trying out, which is Pantene Miracle Rescue Deep Conditioning Treatment. I'm really excited to try this out. All right, y'all, so I'm out the shower. Hair is all done. I mean, hair is all washed. So it took me about 90 minutes to actually wash my hair, y'all. <laughs> well, actually, it took me that long because I had to do a deep conditioning treatment, okay? So, yeah. Anyway, about this deep conditioner, you guys, smells so freaking bomb. It actually works really well. Uh, my hair seems to be pretty clean. The thing is, though, you know when your hair is really clean if um, there's not a lot of smoke coming out when you blow dry your hair. When the smoke comes out, that means you're just drying through a lot of debris or um, extra product in your hair. So, praying that I wash my hair really well because every time I used to go to my um, hairstylist if I decided to hey I'll just wash my hair before I get there you know um she gotta wash it when I, when I get there like she's still washing it when I get there <laughs> so um clearly I wasn't able to wash my hair as good as it was supposed to be for straightening so I'm just praying that this works out so anyway you guys so now what I'm about to do is First of all, I'll put some moisturizer on because I didn't do that. Go ahead and do that real quick. What I'm going to do is blow dry my hair using um, this blow dryer, which is the 2000 Ceramic Ionic Red by Kiss. That's what this blow dryer is. And this blow dryer actually works really well. It works like one of those salon ones, <laughs> you know. Anyway, that. And then I just got some stuff to put on my hair for protecting. So... Okay, so first I'm gonna put this on before I blow dry my hair, which is the uh, Frizz Buster by Fantasia. I'm gonna put this serum on, and this is what I'm gonna put on um, before I blow dry my hair, and um, to eliminate dry, frizzy, damaged hair. So hopefully, and it has al it has no alcohol in it. So hopefully, this keeps my hair from being frizzy when I start to straighten it. Plus, I just open the window, okay, so we can get as much coolant in here as possible. And then um, I'm going to use this when I start to straighten my hair, which is the Cantu um, Thermal Shield Heat Protectant. So I'm going to use that. Then it says it shields hair from heat up to 425 degrees Fahrenheit. And I'm probably going to be using a higher degrees, higher degrees than that. So yeah, but anyway, so I'm going to do my hair and blow dry my hair in sections. That's the quickest way for me to do this. Hopefully it gets done fast. Now the thing is with blow drying your hair, the bet the better you blow dry it, the straighter your hair will come out. And um I don't know if I can do it as well. So hopefully I can um get it as straight as possible with it. But um yeah, we'll pray. So anyway, so what I'm gonna do is go ahead and get some of my frizz serum. Okay, I got this little bottle too because I didn't know how it's gonna work. But anyway. So I'm gonna pour some in my hand. Probably about that much right there. Just put that all throughout my hair. I'm actually gonna comb it through because I want my hair to be stretched as much as possible.
then these are on tight so that I can pull the roots down and hold the roots stretched so they don't try to really go back up. Alright, so I'm gonna be using this flat iron here. I just got this one. It's been about 10 months since I've straightened my hair, you guys. So it's about to be really fun and interesting. That's why I don't own a flat iron because I don't flat iron my hair. This is what it looks like. It's really pretty. It's a one and one fourth inch flat iron. Okay, y'all. So here we go. I am so excited for this. So I went and got a rat tail comb so I can be able to chase it with this. Hopefully they get it as straight as possible. And I'm gonna do now really quick is just comb it out again. So I'm gonna do it all in sections like I said earlier. That's how I do the blow dry process, the washing process, and the straightening process. So I'm gonna use my thermal shield heat protectant. Don't want to spray too much in there, but okay. It's pretty hot. is already done my, my computer my um camera actually overheated earlier so just finish this side so i'll be back when i'm finished with this part okay almost done i have like one section left which is just this part and i did like a deep side part so the rest of this is gonna go this way so let's finish this up gross So, 
Last piece. All done. Let's see it really quick. Wow. It came out so straight, you guys. Look at that. I definitely need to trim my ends, but I want to see how long it was, so that's why I straightened it before I trim my ends, but nice. Hair is all done. So all I'm gonna do now is probably um just all I'm gonna do now is just do my edges a little bit like all these and I usually use a um a straightening comb but I don't have one let me just use this just go in and straighten up my edges a little bit Done. Let me back up so y'all can see the whole thing. <laughs> so this is what it looks like, you guys. From the side. Definitely let me know if you guys um, try out these products because your hair will come out silky and shiny and very soft. I really like the products that I use. This is my first time using them. But, um, y'all, <laughs> I have not had my hair stayed so long. <sighs> oh, I feel so pretty. Anyway, y'all, y'all gotta try out these products. Cause your hair is gonna come out looking nice okay wow i hope you guys enjoyed this video um go ahead and make sure you guys subscribe down below like this video and share with your girls okay let them know that these products definitely will help you get that silky bone straight um flat iron look that you would get at the salon but you do it right at home okay so i hope you guys enjoyed 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 this was so much fun See you guys in the next video. Bye.